Hi, I'm Ben Russell-Smith, Founder and Managing Director here at Laser Lamps. Today I'm going to be talking to you about air. Air is a product which is aimed at the heavy truck sector. It's a product which is a similar size to our famous Triple R1000, which has been popular in the trucking sector for a long time. And with air, we wanted to give a different look and a different feel for those customers that are seeking that same top level performance that they've come to expect and enjoy from the Triple R1000. Uh, but we wanted to give it to them in a package that was different and with a position light that is different in appearance to the Triple R1000. So in terms of the position light, because this is really one of the, um, the big reasons for customers to buy a light for their commercial truck, Air features a unique double position light. So this means a row above and a row below the main reflectors. It's a light guide with a diffuser on it and it's able to be in either amber or white color. So there are three power versions of the Air product. We have the Air 55, which is a 55 watt lamp. We've then got an Air 90. Both Air 55 and the Air 90 feature white circuit boards, which gives them a clear and bright finish inside the lamp. And then we have an Air 130 Elite, which features black internals and a black circuit board to give it a more stealth look. Customers would also see that actually we've got a very interesting lens construction on air. So with air, we're featuring a monocoque structure. So that means the lens is forming part of the structure of the lamp. So it's actually going around underneath the product and you can see the texture and the strengthening pattern that we've got on the underside of the uh, lamp. This gives it real high strength. Of course, it's polycarbonate with a two and a half to three millimeter thickness. That gives it a real unique look. And actually when it's mounted with the beam pointing dead ahead in the horizontal, there's a slight downward angle on the lens, which is allowing any snow that falls in cold climate countries, the snow will just go underneath the lamp and fall straight off the bottom. Lumen output for the Air 55 is 6,800. We then got just over 9,100 lumens on the Air 90. And then we've got a whopping 12,500 lumens coming from the Air 130. The Air 130 Elite doesn't give you really more range and distance than the Air 90, but it's giving you this extra spread. So the beam pattern on the Air 130 is tall. It's got a 17 degree up down spread uh, and then a 34 degree left right. The Air 90 and the Air 55 are both a bit narrower in height. So they are at uh, 13 degrees in the up down, but they've got that same 34 degree width. So yeah, that's really where the extra lumens are going on the Air 130. You'll notice it in the mid range if the Air 130 is mounted up high on a truck, that extra height is really flooding the road and washing it in front of you to give real clear visibility right up there until the one lux line. Air 55 has a E reference of 40. So that is the intensity reference that indicates how much candela output the lamp has according to UNEC regulations. And it runs at that reference 40 all the time. It doesn't have a low output mode. Uh, it only runs at maximum intensity for the 55 watt lamp. The Air 90 lamp is having two output modes. It's got the low output mode and the high output mode. The low output mode is compliant with UNEC regulations and the lamp runs at a EC reference of 17.5. Now, in order to engage the low output mode, the customer needs to remove the boost cap that is supplied with the product. And then they need to add the second boost cap, which is included in the pack when they buy the lamp. And that second cap doesn't have a magnet inside. And with that attached to the lamp, it's now running in the low output mode. So if you're driving between Norway and Sweden, for example, uh, then you can switch out the boost caps to make sure that you're compliant with the necessary laws in each country. The Air 130 Elite has as well a boost cap, so that means it's got the low output mode and the high output mode. 
It's also got a e-reference of 17.5 when it's running in the low output UNEC approved mode. The lamp's got a large heatsink on the back and uniquely the mounts are actually mounting to the aluminium mount underneath the product and the mount can be adjusted from left to right anywhere using these fixing points. Um, in case a side bracket is desired, there's also a side bracket kit that takes the mounting points from the underside and it offers up a thread at the side of the lamp so it allows for side fixing as well. So as with all of our lamps, air is manufactured here in the UK. That includes the metallizing of the reflectors. And actually on air, you'll see a new reflector which is featuring facets, which are delivering light exactly where we want them to achieve this nice height of beam and this wide spread of beam. Manufacturing in the United Kingdom helps us to guarantee the quality of the product. Of course, air is coming with a five year uh, guarantee and it's also IP68 which means it's fully submergible to a meter and a half for more than 30 minutes. The color of light of course is matching our standard 5000 Kelvin and high color rendering index so drivers are not getting fatigued uh, when they're driving using these products. So I hope this video has given you a good explanation and introduction to air. In case you've got any other questions or you'd like to get in touch, we would love to hear from you. Otherwise, until the next time.